Hey family, on November 20th through December 1st, 2022, we will have the all-inclusive Kenya trip. Now, a lot of times people have said, hey, Phil, when's the next trip we will like to go? I want to see Africa for myself, but this is the time to go. Everything will be taken care of. All the excursions are paid. You can do monthly payments. You know, they'll have a safari and a six city tour. You will see Charlie Island, which is something that we did not see last time on the tour. This tour will be 12 days instead of seven days. So make sure to secure your place on the trip by going to www.wbsvs.com, make your deposit, and then you can start making your payments and we'll see you in Kenya. Hello everyone, it's me Demetra K of the Demetra K Show here on YouTube and a proud contributor of the African Diaspora News Channel. If you could please do me a favor and subscribe to all channels and like this video, I would greatly appreciate it. So just recently, Herschel Walker won his GOP primary election and he will be going up against that of Ralph Warnock who is the incumbent in Georgia. They are trying to be the next senator of Georgia. And so right after Herschel's primary win, uh, CNN's reporter Manu Raju went up to him and asked him this. Hey, Manu Raju, with hey, CNN. Doing? I know. You doing? You doing? Right? Are you do you support any new gun laws in the wake of this Texas shooting? Do what now? Do you support new gun laws in the wake well, of this Texas shooting? What I like shooting? to do, what I like to do is see it and uh, and everything and stuff. I like to see it. You know. My favorite yeah. New Jersey teacher. So as you heard him say after he was asked about the shootings that took place in Uvalde, Texas, where children at an elementary school was murdered along with two teachers and the grandmother of the shooter was also murdered. He was asked his opinion about it and he said, what I like to do is see it and everything and stuff. And so people are ranting and raving saying, oh, he was incoherent. He doesn't know how to answer that question, which he probably really doesn't, but I'm just saying, right? So they're going on and now trying to draw this new narrative about him because everything they tried to do, including that of the GOP, because a lot in the GOP didn't want him to get the nomination, but they were trying to say that he uh, was accused of domestic violence and other things in this past. And so now they're bringing up new things to try to tank his campaign by saying he was incoherent, but let's just kind of look at it for what it is. He had just won the primary and they came up, you know, and asked him about what he thought about the shooting. And so he didn't answer the question right, I guess. And so now they're trying to say, oh, he's not prepared for the job. But I mean, come on, he just won, which he was probably really surprised himself that he won. And let's be honest, you know, Herschel Walker is kind of, he ain't all the way there. You know, like the lights are on, but nobody's home type of thing. But to try to say, this is why he's not prepared for the job, I think it's really silly. Because it's like, are you not mad at Congress or the president because they haven't passed the bill uh, that's tougher on guns as far as background checks, not guns, but people getting the guns, like your background checks. I mean, they have more power than Herschel Walker has at this point. So why are you more mad that he didn't answer the question right than you are at the people who have the power in their hands? Now, I know the Senate is making it a little bit hard because there are a lot in the Senate, Republicans, if you will, who are not really cool on passing tougher background checks for guns, but still there's something the Democrats could do, but now you're going to try to run away with this. It's like, eh, you might want to try something else that will really have some weight behind it. Other than he didn't answer this question right, right after he found out he won the GOP primary. So y'all tell me what you think. So for more of commentary, please subscribe to this channel and my channel, the Demetri K show here on YouTube. Peace. Hello everyone. Please make sure you subscribe to the African Diaspora News Channel app on these platforms.